Hey guys, welcome to the Combo Glowdown. I'm Wellington. Um, bringing you guys a pretty neat unpackaging video. This is a random act of kindnesses from two people. Um, not just one, but two. I went ahead, got home today, and uh, both of these came in. Uh, this is a random act of kindness from both Emski and Hitmon Hitman Von Doom. So. Thanks to those guys for sending me some stuff. I know what Adrian sent me. I already know what that's going to be, and I'm really excited to get it. And it got here really, really fast. And uh, I don't know what Brian sent me. And so I'm also really excited to see what that is. And, you know, just really just thank you guys for sending me some stuff. Um, you guys don't have to do that stuff. Uh, you know, and, and to all the people that also send things to each other, uh, you know, all you guys are great people, great friends to each other, great friends to me. Just, I love you guys, love what you guys do, not only because you send stuff, but just because of your presence in the community, presence and just, you know, your your uh, availability to, to each other, to all of us. Um, if things are, if people are down, you guys bring them back up. And then when people are up, you keep them there. And uh, we look out for each other. And whether it be through, you know, packages like this, you know, send a thing that we got extra or whatever here and there. Or, you know, if, again, if we're going through a tough time or whatever, we always got each other's backs. And that's what's so great about this community. And definitely Emski and Adrian are both uh, pillars to that a whole, you know, foundation that we have set up. So anyways, uh, again, thank you to those two guys. Uh, I already started opening the, these a little bit because they're in envelopes and um, it'd be kind of hard to open. So uh, I didn't want you guys to wait too long. Uh, this one, let me see who this one is from. Okay, we're starting with Hitman Von Dooms. And he definitely, and I know why, because this is, a, this is a book, he definitely packaged this very well. Um, oh, wow, he actually put a lot of books in there. was not expecting that. Um, so, let's see what it is. Um, let me read the note real quick. Uh, just see if, um, if I can put it up here, if I can talk. Actually, you know what? Adrian's a cool guy. I don't think he'll mind if I uh, read the note out loud. So it says, hey, hello, Wellington. Found this at an antique shop as well as these other goodies. I'm sorry if it, oh, I'm sorry it is not in better condition. Don't care about condition, man. I got a Scarlet Spider number one that my guy at the comic book short, uh, shop, he had to cut one of the pages because it was, one of the pages was too, was printed too long and longer than the rest. So condition is no problem for me. But he's like, sorry it's not in better condition than it is, but you can always sell it <laughs> and upgrade somewhere down the road or down the line. Anyway, um, happy, oh, happy early Christmas and uh, belated birthday. So I guess this balances out between the two. <laughs> this is a gift. <laughs> um, and then take care, Adrian. Hit my own doom. Um, yeah, so, uh, you can see, got a stack right there. He got the antique shop. And again, I don't care about condition. Uh, like you said, I can upgrade if I ever want to upgrade. And, um, yeah. So, can't wait to open this up. It's a lot more stuff than I thought, than I had been anticipating, if you will. So there's that. Get a quick. Can I rip this off? Can I rip? I mean, he packaged this very well, very nicely, very good. Whatever, however you say it properly is how you say it properly. But that stuff ain't happening here. Ain't no proper over here. You know what I'm saying? Ain't gonna be no proper talking over here. Hey guys, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> um, I'm crazy, guys. I'm so crazy. I really, I'm really glad this this stuff came at this time as well because my weekend 
it wasn't bad. It was just super busy, and so I'm glad I can, you know, have some stuff here that I can be happy with and not about work and school and stuff and stress and all that kind of stuff. So, um, yep, I got the books open, and, uh, oh, bro. Oh, bro. Oh, my gosh. All right, guys. Um, I'll, I'll start off with this one. Uh, just because it's it's not in the same realm as the oh my I didn't even know wow wow Adrian this is awesome stuff bro this is really really nice stuff um okay so special giant size fiftieth issue of Web of Spider Man with an awesome cover there um, I, I love how they got the fifties in the back kind of like the three hundred deal and then behind that is Amazing 290, issue 290, I actually have in that omnibus covers issues like 298 to 317 or something, so that's a pretty uh, close issue, close by issue. Um, this says Peter asked the big question, I'm guessing he, this is where he proposes, I, I'm not actually sure, um, but it's an awesome cover, I'm actually not, I'm not familiar with this book at all, um, so I'm really happy to have it. I think it's my earliest Amazing Spider-Man issue now. Because I just don't collect it because there's too much to collect. And, uh, you know, that Web of Spider-Man issue 50. Really nice stuff there. But uh, this is where he really, really just, just like, came through in the clutch. Um, this is uh, the Judas Contract Part 1 from Teen Titans. Huge Deathstroke story. That's part one. And then he gave me part two. I can't even find the trade to this one. That's how, like, rare these are, I guess. And they're in pretty good condition. I don't know what he was talking about. Um, and then the no part three to it, but here is part four. And this is the finale, so I just need to get part three now. And that's awesome stuff, bro. That is awesome, awesome stuff. I cannot wait to read that. But, you know, the holy grail of this haul and just... I don't know what he's talking about on condition-wise. There's... You know, it's not in the... It's not in near mint. But I would say it's uh, in uh, fine condition. This is the new Teen Titans issue number two. First appearance of my boy, Deathstroke. See him in the back, chilling over there. Yep. Cannot be happier to have this book. It's one of the two characters that I uh, actively collect. Deathstroke and Moon Knight. And now I have the first appearance to Deathstroke. Now I need the first appearance to Moon Knight. And I have my first appearances that I need uh, set. This is freaking awesome. I don't know. I don't know how you got because he has one of these for himself. I don't know how he got an extra copy from an antique store. Uh, the my shop was selling a copy for this for twenty five dollars. I could have bought it at that time, but I just didn't have the money, like willing to spend that much money at that moment. And then somebody came in and picked it up like right then and there, which so I missed out on that and. Uh, it looks like it was a good thing that I missed out on it because I'm 25 bucks richer and I still have the book. So thank you, Adrian. You know, nine minutes into the video and uh, I'm going to get to the Emski package right here. And I don't know what any of this is. I'm already in a super good mood because of, uh, <laughs> and see, you know what? Here's another stack, bro. Here's another stack of books. You guys, both of you guys, jeez, man. You guys, just so good to me. <laughs> Such good friends. 
This says, hey buddy, sorry it's taking me so long to get these out to you. Shit happens, shit does happen, bro. Tell me about it. I got it. Shit happens, bro. I understand. Uh, well, hope you like the books. I threw in a DD reader copy for you. That's cool. I'll uh, check it out, man. I don't know what's in here. Um, and like always, I save everybody's notes. So um, I'm going to try to make sure I don't rip this one. Or maybe I'll just... Oh. Oh. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on, everybody. Stand by. Not gonna, not gonna rip the paper off that way. Cause I don't want to rip the note, guys. And both, both of these guys, man, they know how to pack. Like I, I'm trying to, cause I, I gotta send something out to Emski as well. Um, he asked me for uh, something. I gotta send it out to him. Uh, I just. The, the reason I haven't sent it out is because I'm afraid that I'll package it bad, badly. And I don't want to package this book badly because it's a, it's a really good book. Um, and I want Emsky to have it in you know, the condition that I bought it for. Which is very, like, I don't want to say very fine condition because it's better than that. Um, so, yeah, I want Emsky to have the book in the way it should be had. Um, but anyways... Let's check it out, bro. Oh, dude. Dude. Oh my gosh. All right. All right. All right. Okay, here it is. This is continuing with that Deathstroke craze. Deathstroke issue number 23. Um, haven't bought any Deathstrokes in a while, so this is... I don't have this issue. This is good to have. Uh, for my Deathstroke collection, you know, to go along with now my Judas contract stuff and all that kind of good stuff. Um, here's the reader copy of Daredevil he was talking about. Yeah, it is a reader copy. It's, you know, not in great condition. Um, you know, so much so that it's not bagged and boarded, but who cares? Uh, reader copy, bro, whatever. Uh, issue number 130. I wonder who did the writing on here. Uh, Marv Wolfman. That's pretty cool. And Klaus Jansen was already on the uh, on the. Oh well, he was helping out with the uh, art, so that's cool. One thirty. I'll have that standing by, and then two books that I definitely do not have. Um, I think I think these are Bendis. Stand by, everyone. Sorry. Long video, long video, but two packages, and I gotta do these guys right by, you know, getting my facts straight. Gotta do them right by getting my facts straight. Let me, let me see. Let me take a quick gander. Oh, okay, okay, so, yeah. So, both of these are both done by David Mack, uh, story and art. This is Daredevil, issue number 52, and issue number 55. That's awesome stuff, you guys. I really, really greatly appreciate all the stuff that you guys have given me. And I don't care how long it might have taken, whatever. It's, you know, the gesture is good enough. Um, and then, you know, with the quality of books that you guys sent me, is just tops, bro. It's, it's really nice gifts, guys. Thank you. And, uh, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. I'm Wellington, signing off with the Comic Book Lowdown. I'll see you guys next time.